Hi guys, welcome to another video. My name is Barbara and here we do a lot of lifestyle, beautiful, inspiring content. If you like more of these videos, can you please consider it your home channel and subscribe because you're missing a lot if you haven't subscribed. So today I want us to do a video and I'll call this video a thrift flip. Yes, we have thrifted an item and we want to flip it to make it something new, something fresh. So that is why it's called an inspiring inspiring content so the thing is i have a uh, fiber and i want to use that fiber that i got from my pillows to make something fresh out of it did that make sense so i'm using a uh, fiber from pillows to make decorative pillows so that is a thrift flip so since I already have fiber, I have this black uh, cotton material, so I'm going to do uh, a square case from this to get two pillows. So I'm going to do two cases for the fiber. And then we are going to use this that we thrifted. So these are just normal pillow case covers so these are uh, pillowcase covers so it's one this is how it looks like it's long and on this other side this is how it looks like so if on a normal pillow you just insert your pillow from the back and you're good to go but for me I want to get half of it like that so I'll get two out of this so this, other, this side and this other side, so two from this, then I'm going to put a zipper. So I also bought a zipper. So this was 50 shillings. This was also 50 shillings. Then I bought another pillowcase. I'm sorry about the noise. So there's another pillowcase that I bought and this is how it looks like. So I'm going to get two from this other side, one from this side, then another one from this side. But this side, it has some decorative um, shiny bits going on over there. So they are almost the same color, of which I don't mind using them. They're just decorative pillows for the bed, in case I didn't say that. So I'm going to get two out of that and right there is my machine in case you want to know where I got my machine from I bought it from an XUK shop and it costed me about 20 she it costed me 20,000 Kenya shillings yes 20,000 Kenya shillings for the machine I've actually bought quite a number of things from an XUK shop which were quite amazing so if you like to see a video or items that I got from an XUK shop. Can you let me know? Leave a comment down in the description box. Let me know if you want to see that video. We have talked a lot. It's almost like five minutes. So let's do this. Have I done this before? No. Am I copying from somewhere? No. But it's inspiring. So let's so let's do it.
here, right at the middle. And for this one, yes, we're just going to fold it into half. Then we're just going to cut it here. Half point. So let's do that. So we already cut the pillowcases into two. This is the first one, the one that had some, uh, it was a bit fluffy. So this is one, and this is the other one. Then the one that had velvet, we also cut that into two. So this is one, and this is the other one. So this will determine the size of the pillows. So next we are going to cut this according to this uh, size to get equal. So we are going to make a case out of this, fill in the fiber, then we are going to put zippers on this, the thrifted cases. So we are going to put zippers for the four of them. For the four of them. So let's do um, the pillow themselves from this. So let's make cases out of it. Hi, uh, we are back. We're done uh, with the pillows. So we already made our case, put our fiber in there, and that is how the case is looking like in the pillow. So so we made two of these and we made the cases the same size as the pillow and we put uh, the zipper. So that's the first one. The other one is this one this one was the material was a bit smaller but it stretches so this is another pillow the other one is this one the zipper is still there so all the pillow all the four cases have zipper so let me put the pillows in, then we we'll see how they look like. So the first pillow, that is how it looks like. This one has, uh, it's fluffy, it's very soft. That is the back. This is the zipper side. The second one is here, also fluffy. The zipper, the side, and the back. So now we have our two pillows. That is how they look like. They're fluffy. So these are just decorative pillows that you put on your bed. You can even put on your living space. So that is the first one. Let me put the other one. So the other pillow is this pillow. The one that had silver shining over here. So this is the other one. Looks smaller. Then this is the other one. This is the other one. Also has zipper. So we have two of those. So this they'll be going in at the same time, as in I'll be putting the velvet or the fluffy ones, but the pillows are still the same. That's it for the video of pillows. So the next are frames. I bought the frames at Naivas. They costed me 120 shillings. The size is 8 by 10. So these are just wooden frames. So I bought four of the frames. 
same size four of them but since i don't like the gold or rather because my living room is not more of the color i prefer black so i bought a black spray paint so this i bought at carrefour this was 320 shillings so i'm just going to spray paint uh the frames with the black paint just the frames then find cute quotes for the frames then that's it i just find print and put them in here so for the for the hanging the frames come with these things what are they called the screws so they come with this type of screws to just screw them just there they just put them on your wall so i'll spray paint this find uh beautiful coats for the home then just put them on the wall i'll show you the frames after i spray paint them so let's do that painted our friends they are dry and this is how they look like so I did four of them So right now I'm just going to put the screws at the top of the frames, put the quartz, then put them on my wall. So I'll be adding more of the frames. So I want like 10 frames on a wall because I want to have a wall frame. Yes, I want to have a wall frame. So that's it for this video. Thank you so much guys for watching. Until the next video. Bye.